tank, the Scorpion, built in Britain by Alvis, also emerged in the mid-1970s, although it is officially designated a tracked reconnaissance vehicle. Scorpion is the first of a whole family of vehicles employing the same engine and chassis. Weighing only some eight tons, all are air portable, a factor which has led to their wide export around the world. Scorpion is a three-man vehicle powered by a six-cylinder Jaguar sports car engine, which gives a top speed of 50 miles per hour. More recently, a diesel engine has been fitted, which together with other improvements is claimed to give 30% better performance. The vehicle's cross-country maneuverability is exceptional, and it proved its worth in the Falklands conflict, particularly during the final fighting around Mount Tumbledown and Port Stanley. The vehicle is not amphibious, unless flotation screens are erected, but it can ford water up to three and a half feet deep. Scorpion has only aluminum armor, but further crew protection is afforded by the front-mounted engine. The tank's main 76mm gun fires APDS, armor-piercing, discarding Sabo ammunition, effective at up to some 1,600 yards. A variant of Scorpion, called Scimitar, is armed with a quick-firing 30mm Rarden cannon, which is devastating against other lightly armored AFVs. A 90mm gun can also be fitted to give an even greater anti-tank capability. The use of common parts throughout the Scorpion range makes servicing and maintenance much simpler than in the past. Other members of the Scorpion family include an ambulance, armored personnel carrier, command and engineer vehicles, and a missile-armed tank destroyer. <laughs>